So hi guys, these are the the prints that I'm going to transfer on the t-shirt and this one kind of like came out good and perfect but you guys should see that it's obviously uh, my printer ran out of ink. This is yellow and everything else is, I don't know if that's gonna come out that color. This is like almost colored pink and this is almost like totally pink. This is my first print, the second print and the third print and that's it. And then this is what I'm gonna put at the back of my t-shirt. So these three are for the front um, uh, pictures and then this is at the back. So yeah, let's uh, move on to the next step. According to the instruction, if you're going to cut your print um, to the closest that you can get to your um, logo. So this one I already cut it and I'm just gonna continue to cut uh, the two pictures that was left and then this one. I already cut all of the uh, papers and um, this is ready for ironing but before that just make sure that when you print your stickers also uh, anything that you want to print on your shirt using the fabric transfer this is from Avery and the number is 3271 so when you go to the website which is avery.com print you have to search um, 3271 so you can use that to print your stickers and also um, if you're printing it on your printer make sure um, the setting is on mirror this one I didn't need to adjust anything because I use the Avery.com and then it all it's automatically set to uh, the mirror um, setting these are the shirt that I'm going to use this is size 4 and 5 for Nathan this is for my husband and this is for me number five setting so let's um, leave that iron for like five minutes and make sure there's no water inside it's just okay right now I'm just like ironing up my pillowcase okay we have to lay it flat like that I'm going to iron my shirt making sure it's all wrinkle free so this is how it's gonna look like so what we're gonna do is just we're gonna flip it this way we're gonna lay it flat and whenever you're ready make sure you cover the whole paper Dookie. I can feel that there's a little bit resistance going on. Okay, we're gonna pass it a little bit. Just a reminder, you have to read the instructions first to uh, for the best result. And you have to prepare for everything that you needed, like the of course the t-shirt, the Make sure you also have a, uh, a smooth heat resistant surface. I just, you know, use the floor and put some pillowcase on it and just lay it flat there. And your um, household iron, your inkjet, and I don't know what's the large cotton pillowcase. So I think I'm not going to use that one. If you're going to use the whole sheet of the, of the um, fabric transfer, you have to keep doing it for three minutes. If it's just half sheet, it's one and a half minute. And if it's like a quarter sheet, it will be 45 seconds. So we keep doing this for. Okay, I'm done. Okay, I think this is it. We're gonna let it cool down. You are see are you guys seeing this? This is so cool. Oh, no.
guys, look at this. This is amazing. <laughs> we are now going to take and peel this off the same way. Just have to stretch a little bit. Okay, you ready to see this? This is amazing! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Beautiful! Look at this, guys! I can't believe I'm doing this myself. So pretty. Put this aside. And then, this one is a little cold now. And then we're gonna take this off. Okay, I have a technique. You just have to put this in the corner here. You have to put it, push it a little bit and then the paper will come out. Isn't that cool? <laughs> this is beautiful. Like you can see the color is all in different <laughs> color. But yeah, it's beautiful. So this is done. Okay, since I don't have any board, I'm just going to use this one because I already uh, printed the front so I don't want to ruin that one. What are we going to do next is we are going to put, put it like that just to make sure. Okay. Now we're going to get the other sticker. Remember, I'm printing this for promotion. I'm promoting my own channel. Okay, everything is laid flat, I guess. Okay, when you're ready, done. Let it cool down a bit. And this will be our last. Make sure it's even. Okay, ready? Okay, this is good now. We're gonna just let it cool. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna peel the other side. So this is what happened with the paper. That's all that's left. So we're gonna see peel this off. Oopsie. Oopsie.
is already cold. I'm gonna peel it. Okay. Just have a little trouble around this corner, but I guess that's fine. Let me just take a picture of my shirt. So, yeah. This is how you print your own shirt at home. Thank you guys for watching. I do hope you like my video. So, and I'll see you guys on my next vlog. Bye!